So first, if you want to change your hot water or heating from timer or off to always on or hot water priority, you start by pressing this button, which allows you to select the different modes. So if I press this, now it'll just switch my hot water on. You can toggle through hot water has priority, it's off or it's on a timer, and the same with heating. You can also see the consumed energy here by selecting through here, and you can see consumed electrical energy, and you can see that amount per month. So once you select your hot water on timer, or always on, you can hear my heating switching on and off as I toggle through these. Um, once you have timer, you need to make sure you have a timer circuit or a timer set for your hot water heating or else it won't time on. So you go into your menu. Again, you select your time schedule into your schedule timer for the winter, into your hot water. And in this case, I have it set Monday to Sunday, apart from Saturday, to come on at five in the morning. So I'm going to edit it all of those days. I can switch Thursday on if I wish, but I'm not going to. And you can see that it comes on before we get up, 5.30, for 45 minutes. And that's enough to heat up our hot water. And it does it all at night on night rate electricity. If I want to do it at another time, I can change it. And I can come out and I can go into the weekend and I can set it to heat it up in the afternoon for the kids bath or so on. But I'm not going to do that here. I'm just going to leave it as is. You can also do all of that on the Mel Cloud timer if you wish.